2005 uh, Magnum RT with the 5.7 Hemi engine. Uh, engine modifications consist of port polish decked out head, Canaan intake, and a full boil exhaust. You have a completely one-off hood that you can't buy anywhere in the world. Same thing with the front bumper. You'll see three pieces of uh, aluminum in the front bumper that's actually made for airplanes. It's full custom paint, it's a tri-color. You got a uh, galaxy gray on the bottom, goes into a bluish teal into a black fade. Between the paint is a piece of aluminum airbrushed onto the car. All hand airbrushed, 22 inch Lexanis with Nudo and T55s. Full air ride suspension, car still fully functional. I do uh, drive it, I don't drive it every day, but I still drive the car. Each door consists of a waterfall, and then you'll have a TV, and then a display of a uh, dynamat in each door up front, and then your speaker. The rear doors consist of a smaller waterfall, a uh, TV, and a voltmeter, and then your speakers. Up in the dash, we took out the stock radio. We have a 12-inch touchscreen computer system. We took out the rear windows with a five-pound sludge hammer, broke them out, replaced them with a piece of uh, handmade custom uh, plexiglass that houses a waterfall over uh, a 15-inch TV behind it. The good thing about this car, you can actually touch all the water and you're actually getting wet. Now a 15 inch touch screen back here, same system as you have up in your front, but this is a little bit bigger, so I have controls outside when I'm at shows. Main feature of the car, as you see, is in the middle of the car. That main waterfall is actually pushing out 1,800 gallons of water per hour, which in turn breaks down to almost two gallons of water per second. I have all my sponsor logos come up on the water ball from a home theater projector that's in the overhead console. Your rear hatch consists of a 22 inch TV, Dolby Digital 5.1 amplifier and a Dolby Digital speaker system outside of the car. Everything, your whole nine yards. but just to give you a hint of what's to come, we got the crazy new interior in here. This is the reason why we didn't bring it there to SCP-7. Take a look at that. I tell you, that's the most uncomfortable ride you can imagine. But check out that new seat. That's like the new Recaro seats right there.
those are the new seats for the 300. Check out the back seats. Looking crazy. Going down here to the hypnotic wheels. Looking all crazy. Definitely needing to be cleaned. 